What a game tonight at SB Ballard Stadium as ODU and Virginia Tech squared off much anticipated. That's right. So who came out on top this time? Well, Brian Smith is live at Ballard Stadium with all the highlights. Wow, this was exciting. Wow is an understatement. My goodness. Everybody was expecting, could this live up to the hype of the game four years ago? It more than did that. Let's go right to it. First quarter, it was the Hokies who really were the aggressors early on. This was definitely a defensive game. Uh, that would be Grant Wells, the transfer from Marshall. He goes in from a few yards, and he was in business, making it a 7-0 lead. However, Old Dominion, they were doing their part with defense early on. One of two picks they had in the first half, this one by Terry Jones, wound up leading to a field goal to make it 7-3. to three. Then the Old Dominion didn't catch a break through special teams. Off the Hokie miscue, off a snap, ball just kind of bumbles around for a little bit, and guess what? Robert Kennedy the third says he's housing. 54-yard scoop and score as they led 10-7 to seven at halftime. And that was basically what happened at that point. Then Tech winds up retaking the lead off, a, off of a Wells touchdown pass that gave them the 17-13 lead, but Old Dominion not going away quietly. They march downfield, great catch, pass and catch from Hayden Wolf to Ali Jennings down to the one, and then Blake Watson. What a game. He was starting off slow, but he came through big, literally, with 33 seconds left. He goes in from a yard out, and yes, they wind up lightning getting struck again for the Hokies. They fall as ODU winds up winning by count of 20 to 17. What a way to start off the Labor Day holiday and the college football season right here in the 757. We'll